Day 34. Okay, so I'm kind of wasting away here, getting skinny on the top and getting muscular on the bottom. So this is where Thomas Baxter is gonna come in. Registered massage therapist, certified personal trainer, and beast mode. So hopefully he can build some muscles on this frame. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I wanna hear from you guys. Hey Jesse, pleased that you've uh, been implementing those little mobility workouts kind of at home and it's really good to see that uh, they're working for you and helping you feel loose. Today's uh, workout I'm going to quickly show you is more as you know to prep the body right before you're hopping on your bike. So just to get that little bit of mobility, more dynamic, um, kind of more, more bilateral stretches and just really getting that body quick little preparation for the legs and, and a bit of upper body just to get you ready to rock on that bike. Okay, let's get right to it. So a couple of things you can start with, just getting on a, a bit of a knee march, getting the hips opened up and whether you want to work on a little bit of rotation from this position as well. Okay, we're going to work on the quads, so I want these more active. You can start by walking, but I wanna get you into jogging as well, just to stretch out a little bit. Okay, so getting a good like 20 seconds at least of each of these movements. Then we're gonna get you moving into some hamstring sweeps. So what I'm doing is just hip check back, chest down, sweeping through till I feel that stretch, okay? Hitting both sides, good. And once we've done those, just warming up our calves and getting a little bit of rotation on the lower body, nice and light on the feet, okay? Now, if you want to grab onto something for support so that you can do your leg swings, we're going to start small, build it up, right? So you want to just get a little bit more flexion extension. Again, good 15 each side. Taking your time, hit the other side. Helps to grab onto something so you can really stabilize yourself. Once you've done those, I just want you to go through 10 bodyweight squats really sinking the hips back keeping the knees behind the toes and then we're moving on to a reverse lunge you gotta add that arm reach to help increase and open up that body and the hip flexor and you can even then do five more with rotation each side Lastly, just getting into some chest openers. Nice and easy, maybe do 15 seconds of each of these two. Rotate that hand in behind. And you're ready to rock. All right, sir. So on that note, again, like I said last week, if you are new with us and you're just checking this video out, please feel free to look in the, the comments below. Jesse will have linked um, all of our videos that we've shared together, you'll be able to click on and get to our YouTube channel and check out some of the amazing workouts that we've done, some of the mobility stuff that we've done, which can be a lot of them completed anywhere, just like we are today out in the open. So hope you're enjoying. Please comment, like, subscribe.